Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, uh, see, these are this is a theory, but I am not planning to give it to you. But uh, for uh, because of this website, so key benefits you know already optimize time to value because they will deliver fast because we are making the small uh, uh, each project uh, each phases in uh, we divide into sprint uh, with the time base the one uh, uh, area of assignment that one person is doing in uh, agile actually uh, uh, before you familiar to it or i should explain in a more way at uh, basic level and go ahead go ahead talk about oh, it no. because okay. i'm not no. uh, uh, what is uh, happening that if we are doing a one assignment is one person is doing he will take the time most probably uh 16 hour or 24 hours or three days but same assignment we will put into small bits that uh one person will do this part second person will do this part so in a way one assignment we can divide into four people that we can uh make a uh, uh, 10 hour uh, assignment in two hour two and a half hour so in a way agile uh, methodology is applied so optimize the time to value uh, deliver fast and uh, package uh, low tci uh, offering uh, improve quality and value to customer and customer focus and proof prints so i will go next the basic agile uh, methods so these are the basic uh, I will send, uh, share with you because again, I'm saying uh, theoretical, uh, just I'm giving you overview until our website uh, roadmap will open. Agile sure, sure. Uh, project delivery. This is um, making our customers, uh, customer happy by delivering values. This is also uh, most value theory. So activate methodology for S for HANA, next generation, Agile methodology to drive the customer success. All right, it's saying uh, prepare, explore, realize, and deploy. So these are the four main phases. So uh, one simple modular and agile methodology uh, supporting all S for HANA trans transition scenarios. Uh, one is transition, and uh, second is transformation. Transition is that right now uh, they don't have any ERP and. Uh, if they maybe they have third party software other than SAP, so they are directly going to S for HANA. I don't know. So both we will both will discuss, and also if uh, uh, you will also uh, get the expertise if uh, somebody have uh, ERP and uh, transformation for transformation also one tool SAP is providing, and that in uh, you can uh, put all your erp uh, business processes in that and it will transform to s for hana uh, full support for initial deployment and continuous business innovation and uh, harmonized implementation approach for cloud uh, in uh, for the cloud it is uh, not difficult uh, to implement uh, this methodology because it's also give, uh, providing the two tools, uh, one solution manager and one application uh, life uh, cycle management, ALM. Both are uh, cloud in integrated. And the cloud, uh, we are getting also embedded analytics and uh, other uh, softwares like Ariba, I don't know uh, that I'm purchasing uh, procurement or Ariba. These are the two are separate. Uh, SAP is providing the right now success factor Success factor will be the separate uh, cloud. As for HANA, finance and central components will be there. Uh, 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 second, just a minute. Let me check. Same problem. See, any site, if I'm uh, opening for the SAP, it's not opening. So I don't know what happened. That's okay. Don't worry. Keep, keep no, going. No. Because I don't want that you should lose the interest to the project. Okay. Enables, no, no, no. I mean, uh, I'm very much uh, <laughs> enjoying it. Go ahead. You're uh, doing good. And thank you. Thank you. Uh, enable co-innovation with the customers and accessible for partners. Uh, successor of SAB, 
and SAP launch methodology because uh, it, it will, I will introduce you because these are the words and you will see by uh, yourself all uh, the things when uh, go ahead. This is also uh, theory. Uh, yes, SAP is saying that based on over 40 years of implementation experience. So uh, they have very good product uh, for the activate methodology. Start with best practices. Uh, you are familiar with the best practices? Use ready to run business processes. Uh, because uh, uh, First of all, uh, your team need to sit with the customer and uh, he will ask what process you are running from end to end. Okay. If they say that, no, we want from scratch. Okay. You can go from scratch to build the process. But SAP is uh, providing in the world that they are saying best practices for 200 and more companies. They uh, build uh, these best practices. You can choose from there the processes and uh, you can fit it to with your customers' processes. Um, uh, you got my idea? Or before you saw best practices uh, processes or not? Because I yeah, will yeah. also, okay. Yeah. So, it, I, okay. Uh, uh, validation will validate to best practices with a fit gap workshops. So the, the workshops uh, that is showing the process end-to-end -end process. And also in best practice, you can uh, get the document number one, uh, presentation document fl uh, flow, uh, process flow. Uh, second, you can get... Uh, front end uh, running the process and back end configuration document also you can get and also sap is providing the file to upload to the system that process will be there and only you need to upload uh, the master data and uh, locations so modular and scalable and agile structure of project lever solution incrementally that if you are extending your project uh definitely uh, you have very good experience so i'm not going in more details so cloud ready cloud ready that uh, uh, as SaaS, you have a software as a service uh, no tensions for infrastructure or any installations and operating systems uh, premium engage engagement ready uh, build and run fully supported via sap control center As also right now a new product is there rise with sap sap is taking full control and uh, your implementation they are also uh, um, uh, helping you to implement uh, on the cloud base quality built in identify the risk early uh, with the total quality approach we will do also quality gates in uh, the project our project, we will start from the scratch, okay? Agile application lifecycle management. Uh, delivery of the requirement via release. Okay, one thing, Mr. Manish, uh, you should know. These all presentation uh, will be provided to you also. And these are available also on Roadmap Viewer. So SAP, is, uh, they, they provided it. I, I, I do, do not uh, do the effort to prepare it in my way. So SAP is giving you the best, uh, also best uh, presentations and templates, all templates. Okay, uh, okay. first, okay. So uh, no worries that these presentations are very nice. <laughs> Big size pieces, uh, business needs, deployment model, uh, roadmap, uh, baseline scope, and a release planning. So a scope validation, uh, decision uh, requirements to scope what is our requirement and what is uh, the scope the scope validation and then implementation uh, uh, release in sprints uh, the sprints as i told you that uh, you will divide all your assignments in small chunks of time you will link to the time and, and that way your team will be do the uh, scrum manager will be in between that team uh, you are not assigning all the roles to the team. The scrum manager, what he will do, he will take the charge and daily basis, he will uh, ask the guys, technical guys, ABAP or technical guys or business process consultant to do this in a day. But 
the process from end to end when you will run it you will get the gaps uh, with the respect to the customer so you will not face any problem that end of uh, the month or two months that business process have some backlogs the backlogs are that the customer is not satisfied because sometimes you are implementing the process as per customer's requirement uh, but some uh, requirement uh, he missed or he did not felt that that requirement will be there so that backlogs again we have to uh, divide into four parts um, must do and have to do or we can accept these uh, four parts that, that uh, uh, divided into four parts so in that way you can get exactly the picture of the backlogs that uh, how to resolve these uh, problems integration test definitely and deploy next you can see the agile project delivery with the sap activate uh, by the way mr manesh this is uh, exactly what you uh, act 100 and act 200 from there I uh, took the presentation from uh, roadmap, so I, uh, I have planned for this. So agile project delivery with SAP Activate, uh, managed cloud on or on-premise project example. Uh, lower side, you can see uh, prepare, explore. This area is the explore and realize, deploy and release. And this is a timeline. Here you see, that four, uh, three parts or four parts, I am saying that for the backlogs, must, should, could, and would. What are the outcomes from uh, backlogs that we can, sometimes we cannot do the things. So it, it is giving the priority. The priority wise, you will have an Excel template that in that it will showing you the uh, complete picture of the backlogs. So uh, when you will uh, here, you will do in explore at the end, you release sprint plans uh, on the basis of backlogs and uh, checkpoints. Each area you will do the base build and fit gap analysis. And after that, a release and sprint plan. Then you will put these as uh, sprints to build your solution. And uh, from there that uh, integrate and testing. So after planning, again, you will go for the testing and run. Then it will, again, you will divide all your assignments to the sprints. Any question uh, for this screen? No, no, no. So what is this? Uh, can you go back one? Uh -huh. yeah, so yeah, yeah. Af after deploy, what are those three sprints? Uh, 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 after, just a minute, oh, sorry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Plan for the plan. A, a release and uh, a sprint plan. B because every phase you are oh, fi finalizing uh, your assignments and then dividing uh, these uh, assignments to the sprint uh, for the all team. For each team have one scrum manager that he is doing uh, he's in charge yeah. because uh, also one thing is that a sprint and scrum manager it's a, a very good strategy that you will directly communicating to scrum manager they are uh, responsible uh, like resi chart responsible accountable uh, accountable or uh, information so they right. will be the responsible to get the job done uh, from the team because if you are communicating to the all people, if maybe if you have project in 20 people or 10 people or 15 people, uh, so in that way, you are getting exactly what is they are doing and you are receiving from Scrum Manager. Uh, let's say if you have seven modules or four modules. So you are dealing with the Scrum Manager and they are making uh, uh, the all uh, reports because templates will be there and they are providing you the templates and you can put your uh, presentation dashboard and you can present to the steering committee. Okay, now yeah, I should okay. go to the... Okay. What does... Okay, uh, discipline motivated, I'm going next, okay. Uh, when the position agile method customer projects, agile, so it is also very big theory. 
Okay. Um, agile. I I told you exactly that. Just a minute. Yes. Sorry. Okay, one phase uh, I done for you agile, and second I'm going the agile team roles and responsibility. Agile roles and responsibility. Actually, most probably these things I. Um, uh, it depend upon you that how you will manage the roles and responsibilities. Sometimes your team is a, like a family and uh, you are not uh, getting the full team. Uh, one person, maybe he's uh, doing the two roles or three roles. So uh, this is again, I'm saying that it's a theory process owner, implementation team, scrum master, agile project governance, and uh, Scaling agile uh, product owner uh, com uh, complexities. How to start scaling agile team? So agile role and responsibility. From here you can uh, design your role and responsibility. So the core project role board of architects and other functional roles. Functional roles maybe two or three or four. Customer roles and responsibility. Customer uh, responsibilities and core project roles. A business process architecture role and other functional roles. These can be one role or either three role or either one person is doing for project organization examples. Agile role and responsibility, the core team consists of process owner, mm -hmm. product, and customer represent is a representative of the business. Uh, the process owner for each department, one process owner will be there because he will be signing the user acceptance tests. Uh, most probably, you, um, you are familiar with all things because these uh, are not new theories. As yeah. Scrum master, as Scrum master, that I told you, the coordinator between the your team and you, implementing Im implementation team, uh, SAP, IT, customer, subject matter. Uh, experts uh, also subject matter experts and process owner these are the both uh, vice versa they will help you to provide you the process other supporting roles project manager and you will be manager sponsor uh, stakeholders testers architects and operations these are the common things that you uh, been doing role summary uh, process owner team scrum master uh, see you can see here he is the in between that he is doing and uh, getting the responsibility with you with the and uh, with the process owner also here sap agile uh, team you can see the uh, scrum team uh, optimal team size 7 plus minus 2 people so scrum master here, uh, business process expert, tester, authorization expert. Uh, sometime uh, business consultant, he is taking care for all the things, technical expert, training expert, and technical expert for here, and SAP functional process owner. So one represent team member, uh, the, the scrum, these are the uh, uh, scrums of the scrums, because each, level the coordination uh, between the lower level to upper level so technical team operation so this is diagram that no will be more, most probably a, more complex process owner it's a giving the definition of a process owner i think you are very very good familiar with because you have very good uh, project experience Process owner represents the business and a process owner is responsible for the success of business implementation from 
business representative. Uh, if we, you are using the SAP best practices, definitely uh, process owner have to agree that uh, some level the process he need to do according to the best practices. And in a way, if he's convinced that he ask you to implement SAP best practices, that his life will be more easy. Sometime our cultural values, uh, we are putting our cultural values to the business process also. Okay, business process, he owns a project backlog because he is telling you that here he want in this way. Uh, he decides on the what has to be implemented. Implementation team, it's uh, team members gives answer to the process owner how use as many SAP standard Let me check maybe our, yes, it's open now. At last. Okay, uh, you, I have to provide you the user ID to uh, explore uh, the project because each uh, training session uh, when I will finish uh, how you will do the training sessions with me uh, Mr. Manish okay. so so one second right? <clears throat> looks like you got the connection right Let, let's let's do one thing if you want to finish out the topic what you're covering let's not jump here directly I know you have access uh, I'll also try to get the access um, uh, shortly but you want to finish up what you're covering in the middle Just a minute, my mother. Once, yeah. um, okay. Amin, okay. Yeah, just a minute. Okay, uh, until uh, it's login and I will. Okay, yes, I'm saying that how you will manage uh, the training because uh, continuous, you are saying seven days, two hours training. In between, how you will do the practice? You will get the time because I need to give you the assignments also. Hmm. Because what I will show you and you will do it in a way that you, because uh, uh, the roadmap viewer is uh, going out uh, from that website and giving you the product knowledge, process knowledge, and uh, uh, other things uh, to explore. Like discover, you need to go to the solutions, best practices. Yeah, so, so what we'll do, um, you know, let, let us, let we'll me do first, and, uh, yeah, let, let me first understand the conceptually what, what, what this is all about. Let me get access mm -hmm. and just let me get into the system and see because I don't know my role whether I'll be hands on doing this or the team will be doing it, overseeing. When I get into the project, I will know more about that, right? Or maybe at least uh, yeah. Yeah, next, yeah. next week. So I, I don't want to take this and do everything hands on. It's good mm -hmm. to know and good to have a little mm -hmm. bit of practice. Definitely. But uh, yeah. I don't know whether the expectation would be for me to go and do all this configure myself i don't mm -hmm. know yeah, thank you. Uh, no right. problem no but now actually i'm just planning uh, as per your, uh, uh, comfort zone uh, right. that in a way that i will go straight forward uh, the project and that will be the not issue uh, definitely your team will be doing all the things and uh, that will be easy for you uh, to ma uh, you have to manage the things okay that's my understanding but uh, mm. what what needs to be managed? What is the concept behind it that will help me to understand? So I think you're continuing mm. with the, the theory part right now, and then once you're done, uh, yeah. once you're done with this theory complete, then we'll I will try to get into the system, see whether I have access or not, and all that stuff. Okay. Okay. 
okay uh, see uh, uh, the implementation team i cleared with you and uh, uh, a scrum master uh, its role uh, what he's doing ensure that team is fully can, functional can you both go back and sorry. has focus sorry, sir, can yeah. you go back one slide i don't yeah we, we are not covered or maybe i missed it. okay yeah, go ahead go uh, implementation team i i know what it is okay let's go ahead okay. to the next one yeah uh, yeah yeah you you know very well this yeah. is uh, yeah, maybe uh, a new role let's say uh, as per uh, uh, activate methodology uh, ensure that team is fully functional and uh, productive and has focus uh, because some uh, normally in uh, production area we are saying it's a supervisor so enable uh, close uh, cooperation across all roles and functions and remove barriers this is main part that sometime he need uh, do the politically the handle the both parties to be happy uh, shield shields the team for external and in interferences because sometime uh, that direct uh, exposure to end user and consultant uh, sometime the consultant he is uh, focusing on uh, configuration or business process so he cannot communicate to the end user so there can be a conflicts mostly because i'm also managing the projects so i'm not uh, uh, exposing my functional or configuration consultant to directly to the end users uh, mostly end user they uh, i don't know america what is the culture but i'm telling you the middle east and saudi arabia culture that end user they are feeling that he need to be get Um, familiar with the business process owner to make the changes directly uh, done without the scrum master ensure uh, okay scrum master ensure that the process is followed advice to daily stand up meetings iteration review and planning meetings ensures a successful scrum process in a project he is a pure process facilitator motor and motivation of the team plus generic project management task as a project manager pmm a resource allocation kick off these are the actually high uh, high level project implementation enhancement these are the parts that he is doing project tools enhancement and modification Uh, transfer management project charter organization these are also the roles for that critical scrum master scrum master uh, each team has its own scrum master who ensure that team adheres to scrum process values and rules uh, facilitates team work and status by organizing daily scrum stand up meetings uh, prepare together with the product owner and team sprint and uh, release the planning because uh, at each area that he know that right now our planning is at top level that we can release it uh, for the you know, pro, uh, implementation monitor progress of the sprint and release backlog uh, protects the team by external uh, that also again provide the team uh, with the whatever the team needs to be more productive some tools some availability it is the scrum master that works for the team not other way around co located with the team scrum master is the interface to the project share holders and not directly working with the team agile project governor so here uh, we have uh, scrum master responsible for consistent scrum execution and standards one and three teams one for three team one for three scrum team yeah yeah okay okay a work work team and scrum team finance so here it is a finance works in sales and distribution it's your family with it uh, manufacturing and procurement here a uh, scrum of uh, scrum 1 dash n they are coordinating each other because uh, the four scrums they are doing with the 
finance, distribution, manufacturing, and procurement. And again, one scrum is that with the four scrums, uh, they, he will focus on integration topics and um, cohesive solution. Uh, build consistency consistency uh, consists of a lead consultants and the product owners uh, from individual scrum teams you got the idea for this no, mr it's uh, yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. I, very I, common i'm very this, i'm very comfortable with what you're going through all i yeah. need is I need to talk about uh, the documentation part and everything, but yeah, you go ahead. I'm understanding everything. I mean, okay. uh, this is something we go through. Uh, Agile anyway. uh, coach, um, executive steering uh, committee, and this is core team. Actually, you are family, and uh, so just name is changing, and um, you are managing these things. Uh, okay, product ownership and the complexities. Uh, chief product owner. So in our finance, sales, and manufacturing, and procurement owners. So planning and asset management again, it's uh, uh, it depends on how you have team and how you uh, arrange the people in a way. Actually, this is saying scaling, scaling agile. Uh, you are dividing the each area uh, to the uh, you, if you have more people. How to start scaling agile team? Guiding principle global agile programs. Start with a small core team to set up project structure and identify initial product backlogs. Okay. Second, on onboard team members gradually over time and identify leads and coaches as scrum team are build up. Build up onboard team members gradually and stick to the agile principle that is most important but replicate them in the scrums of scrums the supervisor of supervisor identify a core team to focus on the planning activity the planning activities are most important as you have experienced identify a dedicated integration team to focus on integration aspects including architecture, functions, technology, and organization. Change management is the most important. OCM is the most important thing. Uh, leverage a hierarchical product backlog that has multiple product owners and is decomposed to into work stream backlog. The work streams uh, list, I, uh, I think you know, uh, I show you the works team uh, list, uh, Mr. Manish. You want to see, or uh, we will? Uh, I, I will finish it, and then I will tell tell, tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You finish first. Yeah. Finish. Okay. As necessary, start uh, with the pilot project to demonstrate agile stress. Working with the pa uh, parallel, uh, we have uh, it's show showing that how uh, the team you can uh, arrange uh, the finance uh, sale distribution manufacturing procurement in between the master is there and weekly bi-weekly product owner meeting the team working and goals and scrum have responsibility to uh, uh, their respective team to the results Scrum of Scrum Backlogs, this is again uh, dividing uh, the program, uh, how the product uh, it's, uh, features. So when it's uh, actually it's diagram is showing you, but uh, when you have a team, then definitely uh, this uh, figure will give you very good impact how you will manage. Okay. It, uh, now we, uh, first of all, we covered the agile roles and responsibility now, SAP roles and responsibility. Sample project organization. Uh, it, this is a recommendation. Mm, um, I think you are also familiar with it. That host steering committee, project sponsor. Uh, Most likely, this is very common. And uh, I will go ahead because this diagram is available. When you have team, you can manage it in a way. 
Then next, I'm going program manager. Uh, responsibilities, task, special knowledge, and reporting to. So uh, program manager, it's very clear by name that he's a managing uh, point between the customer and uh, the static partner and SAP during all triangle with the SAP also he is in implementation taking care of a sport as with the SAP global multi site all it's known a project manager this is also you are familiar with but uh, for for your documentation uh, you have need to send to the project manager what is responsibility you can take from here project manager continue special knowledge uh, reporting to and corresponding because these uh, all roles are in, from here it is taking to the next program project manager pmo office the responsibilities the program and project officer responsible for the professional operations of program project office regarding to the following tasks quality manager Again, it have uh, responsibilities, tasks, special knowledge, and reporting to corresponding customer roles. Okay. Please, one one back. Yes, please. One, one question. Do you have a chart wherein all this, um, all these are shown in a in a like flow diagram or or a chart, organization chart, wherein mm -hmm. where is this program manager fits, wherein quality manager? Just one one chart showing all this. Roles and responsibilities are good, which is very good. Uh, that will See, give you actually, a... actually, these, uh, mm, uh, it, it will be available in Excel sheet also during our uh, uh, roadmap. And also, uh, these are the roles and responsibilities will be, we are assigning uh, the our resources in the project, MS project. Their all role will be there. No, no, no. From, no, no. Yes. Uh, uh, no, no, no. What I'm saying. My question is, do we have a slide here, the way you're showing mm -hmm. this slide, right? Do we have a slide wherein we have all these roles and responsibilities? Mean, I like this, something like this I'm talking about. Uh, yeah, this yeah. Like this, it uh, yeah, it can be arranged because all roles will be there. See, uh, uh, steering committee, project sponsor and project uh, program manager, this here, uh, business owner process, architecture, PMO, quality manager, and value here, application. So in the, this way, organization chart will be available, definitely. Uh, I mean, do we have something in this slide or you have to go and find right it? Right now, I don't have, but I will arrange because I just, uh, uh, for, in first two sessions, uh, I'm familiar with what kind of training you need. and what No, 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 that's fine. That's fine. Not yeah, yeah. Not yeah, yeah, yeah. If you can, if you can please find, like, you know, especially this will be my it, role program manager. It, uh, so where will I fit in, you know, just to get an idea of what is mm. the recommendation, right? Uh, actually, so this I'm is not... you're saying exactly right. This is sample. Uh, uh, sample project organization, okay, a recommendation. So uh, uh, these uh, roles, program manager, where it will be there, and we will put here the pro. Uh, no, no. So, so let's 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 stay here. Let's stay here. Uh -huh. Where you think, if you, if at all, you build a a, pro, a st organ structure, where uh -huh. you think this program manager role will fit in here? Uh, you see, program project management. Uh, this is a main here. Okay. The, okay. Steering committee and project sponsor, these are the customer. Okay. So, you uh, are program company. manager, yeah. The program manager, that's one de level below. That's where you think program yeah. manager fit in or one level below? Uh, see, uh, uh, Mr. Manish, also, uh, the project sponsor, if you are employee uh, in you are come, uh, you are the employee and you are managing the project, SAP project, or you are consulting company and you are sitting in the company because uh, I'm taking as an example and also SAP is showing that why they are saying PMO, project manager office. Because what is this that you are a company that providing the solutions and you are implementing. No, no, no. But if so, you are, you are, yeah. you are their employee and you are managing the project, you are taking care of all of things. And you can be the here in steering committee or project sponsor. No, no, no. In my situation, we are the mm. implementation partners. We are not the business owners. So mm. I think the the program management program management is where that role will fit. In. I'm assuming, right? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's all right. This, That's what I think. Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, let's yeah. move on. Let's move on. Just yeah, if yeah. you can please if you can please build a chart like that, that would be helpful. That's fine. Mm -hmm. Let's move on. That, that will uh, will not take the time. I, I will bid exactly uh, that location. Um, that team member uh, for twenty team members, uh, I will bid a, a organization chart. Okay, perfect. Let's move on. Yeah. The project manager, uh, program manager, quality manager, and uh, business consultant, B um, uh, value expert. Okay, uh, because these role and responsibility is a theory, and uh, you know very well because uh, you are project manager. So. I'm giving the training to a project manager, so I need to be very careful about both no, 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 that's fine. Yeah. bridging the gap between the business, uh, business and IT. So IT also, it's a, a big issue that uh, technical architecture, how to build, but uh, because of uh, BTP business technology platform and uh, this uh, uh, SaaS, SAP uh, software as a service. It's a very uh, good that you have no very less communication with the uh, technical architecture team. But if on premise, definitely a lot, a lot of hurdles that you need to wait installation of project, uh, the servers. Okay, got it. Enter uh, enterprise architecture. Uh, this is also maybe. You again, uh, same thing. I'm saying you that uh, how uh, the, your architecture, your servers, and uh, you are managing the things with the IT. Um, sure. Because uh, some company they have separate two areas. Uh, one is ERP SAP department, or, or one is IT department. Uh, some places okay. the ERP general manager or uh, program manager or project manager, he, uh, IT manager is reporting to him. And some places, both areas are separate. This depends upon culture values and uh, depending on the situation. Mm -hmm. Before, uh, 10 years before, IT manager was very strong. Uh, he's not uh, giving the room to ERP people. But gradually, uh, SAP or ERP, uh, took the place and you know, mostly company they are hiring combination of a person that he can manage uh, IT and plus uh, ERP both. A business innovation architecture I'm going uh, next which is also I will make for you uh, create one organization structure that all you can see yeah just all the roles. Yeah, on I, one I know this will be uh, it will be helpful this this in individual responsibility is very good and I, yeah. most of them i i think most of them i understand from project yeah. experience what i have but like a, in a typical s4 hana environment and mm -hmm. considering we are we are the uh, what we call uh, implementation partner we are not uh, project sponsor or something you know yeah. we're not a project yeah. sponsor and all so how will that work that's all okay okay, okay. Uh, technology consultant, test management consultant. Okay, please. Yeah, Data yeah. migration architecture. Architect, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I know all this. All, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Integration development consultant. These are the roles actually. SAP is saying yeah. these are the roles. So, uh, yeah. organization change manager. This is important. Yeah. Uh, how how do uh, uh, you have experience in projects for this area? Yeah. How will you manage because. Uh, some mm -hmm. areas you uh, find difficulties, but I don't know in the uh, US, but it's a developed country. Definitely there will be difference or it's the same like our countries uh, in Saudi Arabia or you Middle East or India or Pakistan. Yeah, yeah. So change, change management is basically, you know, any any changes you're bringing to the processes and all, you know, how how best we can implement those those kind of organization change management, right? So that's what they, they do. Uh, mm -hmm. you know, so, so you will have a team, dedicated team, they will have to talk about, you know, mm -hmm. you have to do a risk analysis and just say why this is needed and, you know, what's the, some of the pros and cons and what are the benefits of being, changing the process and all. So you have to talk about yeah. this kind of thing. Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. When, uh, uh, this is, uh, again, continue, continue agenda. No, uh, customer roles and responsibility. Three areas were there, uh, Agile, SAP, and customer. Last were for project uh, organization examples. 
So here for customer, definitely you have a, 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 a business process owner and maybe uh, what is say the expert for uh, the business process expert uh, person, uh, subject level expert person. So in well, planning, uh, primary responsibility for customer will include planning and executing project, managing the project, including the timelines and work group, testing, resources, training, documentation. Yeah, I think you move on. I, yeah, I understand all this. I yeah. understand, yeah. Customer, yeah. common uh, customer yes. rules, common customer like, com Yes, here are some common customer project rules along with the definition, okay? Uh, project sponsor, uh, steering yeah. community, and pro customer project manager, quality yeah. manager, and yeah. decision makers, and so customer well, business. Can you, go, can you go back last, next, last? Yeah, time? customer team lead team and uh, LOB, line of business. LOB, line of business. Line of business manager. Okay, got it, got it, got it, got it. Uh, and yeah. we will see here that quality IT implementation. Yeah. Custom team lead, line of my decision makers, and SAP is also providing uh, industry level solutions and line of business uh, solutions because uh, industry level they are taking it to manufacturing, retail, utilities, and line of business they are taking it to um, finance uh procurement hr customer business process architecture customer solution uh, expert business solution architects uh, these are known things i'm going ahead customer business process expert customer business process expert continued sme customer technical mm -hmm. small medium uh, the customer system administrator line of business yeah. yes customer test coordinator uh, customer team members mm -hmm. um, customer education coordinator that he will mm -hmm. educate the people that how the processes work yeah training and uh, yeah. service service desk uh, yeah. right now several uh, software are available um, third party jira is there because the service yeah, desk yeah. how uh, i don't know uh, you are managing in a way because uh, a solution manager is also there, but uh, actually sometimes we have a bulk of tools that we need one from that okay. agenda. I know it's a project organization example. Uh, see what you are saying. This is uh, uh, this is showing in a way a steering committee, project sponsor, project manager, and uh, application, finance, sales, manufacturing, analytics. Solution architects also, it's not complete, but it's again sample, mid-size, mid-size project organization. Uh, program level, this uh, uh, chart, this is a project organization. Again, it's coming, I think, before you saw it. Application management area, mm -hmm. uh, for, uh, example of process and function teams, a different, uh, showing the different diagrams for, as an organization structure. Solution architect and board of architects. Examples. So, so all the, all the, examples. yeah, all the, you know, the duties, roles and responsibilities, what we went through, they are showing in a chart. That's all. Actually, it is showing actually examples. Uh, correct, any example correct. if it fit to you, you can take it. Correct. Example C, process non-functional. Correct. Uh, correct. Diagram. Training, design, execute. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 So you can. So, uh, you so, can. Please uh, so, go ahead. Okay, Zahid. So one thing. So there are two things now. One is we went through. This was very good. This was today very good. Now, do I have access to these slides for me to go through? Yeah, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. You can go. Very easy. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now, is 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 this guy who's on the call? Zahid is on the call, or somebody from the ERP yeah. training? Uh, let me check because how many people are there in a meeting because I did not listen him and he's let me check on the WhatsApp maybe. Uh, see, uh, the thing is that I will uh, um, coordinate uh, uh, with you uh, to give you the links in a way and I will give you small uh, level uh, guidelines that 
you can browse and automatically you can go and you will find it's a nice way that how to browse uh, the um, project. Uh, you know, so, so here is what I would like to tell you. What I prefer is, I, if you can, so whatever you went through the presentation now, right? Um, so if I have access to these slides and all, I can go through these ones myself. And mm -hmm. I, if I need it, I can have my hard copies and all like this, so that, you know, I can see sometimes whenever I'm not near the computer and all, I can actually go through some of the slides myself, yeah. right? That's what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah. So now only thing is for that, we need to have a link so that I can go and have access to it and then all that stuff. Okay, so that okay. is one part. So all of whatever you have covered just now to me is, um, so if you can go back to the first slide, wherein uh, first you showed time. me, no, Agile you showed, uh, no, no, wherein you showed me that, you know, these are different phases. So you'll go into the system and actually build this all yourself, right? Mm -hmm. You showed me the first slide. No, first I showed you this one project. Yeah, that's what. I, what is this? Actually, this is MS uh, Office uh, project. MS uh, MS okay. Office uh, pro okay. project. Uh, this is actually your timeline. Everything is uh, with the days, hours uh, okay. uh, here. And uh, just a minute, I will show you. Well, uh, uh, here is the uh, process. Uh, Mm, got it. I, I got yeah, it. This is the box teams. Okay. Here, box teams. Here we have so the is project. This, is this a sample you are showing, or is this something your life project experience? What you did? A project plan. Looks like this is uh, a no, project actually, plan. No, actually. This is exactly project plan. We will build it right uh, from scratch. We will start on the uh, uh, roadmap overview from here because it's no, not loading no, again. No, no, Tomorrow we no. will connect it and uh, we will do it from the scratch. Perfect. Uh, my my question, is, yeah, please. Guys, my question is, see, building and all myself is very good. I definitely would be interested, but I would like to go through this myself today evening, my time. We hear it's afternoon, right? Mm -hmm. So. Mm -hmm. To get an overall holistic picture of this, what you're showing, what under prepare, what are the different tasks are there, under explore, what are the different tasks are there. Okay, so mm -hmm. if I want to go through this myself and go through those slides, mm -hmm. who do I reach out to? Because see, I don't have days and all, I have hours only left here from starting on the project. So I have to spend like go through two hours with you, spend five, six hours myself to go through this so that I can catch up. Right now, today, at what time you have spare time, uh, you want to browse this uh, complete project? See, uh, it's it's Friday afternoon, so I'm 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 almost finishing my day because okay. another one hour I'll be done. Then I have whole afternoon and evening okay. till we join the call tomorrow. I have all this time to go through this. So if I catch up with this uh, tomorrow when we come, we can actually configure in the system. Go and build okay. the, the project plan. Okay. Uh, if I don't, uh, if I don't go through this now, if I don't yeah, yeah. go through this now, then tomorrow I'll be struggling in conception. Uh, Mr. Manish, I want also uh, because see, I am giving expertise to the person that he will be capable. And uh, see, uh, what happen if oh, I one second, huh? Zay, 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 yeah. one second. Zay, Zay, one second. Let me call Zahir. Hey, Zahir, yeah. are you on the call? Zahir, are you on the call? One second, huh? let me put on you. I, I know you are doing a very good job, but I need some support from them. Also. One second. Huh? Yeah, training, uh, ERB training host is there, yes.
Zahid, I spoke to Zahid. He's coming on, on online here. Okay, we'll talk okay. about it. I'll, I want to understand how do I get access to these slides and this uh, project uh, project plan, what you're sharing. And, and then, of course, how do I get access to the viewer, right? A roadmap view, okay. viewer. But, uh, so one thing I need your business email. If you are business email, I can create your account for in my company that uh, right now um, uh, you have a SAP SSID. I do have to check uh, here. Hmm. Why I can't, we can't do it on personal email, right? Mm -hmm. But then no problem. You can do because uh, you have to register. If I uh, see, uh, yes. if I yeah. yes, Zahid. Hey, Zahid. Um, first of all, Zahid is doing a great job. Okay, I'm very okay. happy that he's doing a good job. Now, what I need some help from you is he has shared some slides and uh, you know, um, and he has also has a project plan and everything. Because I have very limited time, my weekend is starting here. Mm -hmm. So till tomorrow, see what the slides, what he's showing. He has about 25, 30 slides and then one project plan. I want to have access to this today, now, now if possible, so that after this training, I can go through this myself and get familiarized with it. So that tomorrow when I come and he'll start something else, I am a little ahead of the game. In the sense I have conceptually understood what, what is this all about. Can you provide this? Because I know... You, will, you said you'll be providing the access mm, to it, right? No, sir. This is not under my control. Okay. Actually, this is completely the SAP portal, okay, where uh, uh, those who are walking into the company, those having ID, they can work on that exactly on the SAP portal, okay? So, listen, um, Zahid, mm -hmm. I, I don't know how your internal things work, all I know is I need this ASAP. Okay. Zahid, you got a good guy who is trying to help me. He did a very good job. I need to catch up with these slides. Yes. You can check with us, uh, Zahid Iqbal. No? That, uh, he, he will guide you how to. Because this is the SAP portal. And there's a SAP portals. I think that he is something showing from the SAP standard portal. So I don't have this type of access. Zaid, Zaid, what is, is yeah, this? Yeah, is yeah, yeah on, no problem. Then is this on the online on the SAP portal or is it something you're, you can download yeah. and send it to me or what? See, it is uh, uh, a roadmap viewer and from there, uh, step by step we are going. And from there, I slide showed you that uh, uh, I will send it to you. But otherwise, you will be going to website without my training you will uh, find nowhere i will send you no, the no, slides no, which is fine uh, yeah. which is fine uh, uh, all uh, i guys, see uh, uh, that yeah. will you please share the link which you are showing the poll tools okay so he can able to okay. access with his company id okay because it is no uh, yeah, yeah because it's a limited authorization right? so uh, maybe the some slides available some are not available uh, but I can send these. Uh, I'm not uh, asking this about slide. I think he's asking for the tools, right? The, the tools your the URL link, so the portal which you are running. For yeah, yeah, portal. Them, yeah. I I will send you the link, okay? Yeah. So, you can yeah. Share so link. Zahid, so I, I don't know. Again, uh, see, this is something I will take some time for me to understand how this all works. But uh, if you, Zahid, if you can send me the link, let me. Click and see whether I have access. If I don't have access, what's the procedure to get the access and all? Because see, that mm -hmm. is important for me. If you, you can go through this 20 hours, I can even say, yeah, it looks good. Everything I, I I know what you're talking about. But this is in a very structured way. So I want to understand this in a structured way. Mr. Right? Manesh, one, one thing I will do. I will send the link and also manual to you how to use that portal, okay? And uh, that portal is available for uh, uh, company uh, SSID, SAP SSID and also anonymous. Anonymous, you can enter and uh -huh. you can browse. If somewhere you else you find that authorization not there, then I can provide you the user ID. No problem. Okay, Zahid. Hmm. Uh, I think you... that uh, S user ID you can get from your company, right? Mm -hmm. I have one here. Yeah. I have yeah. one. Uh, yeah, th that yeah, you, so can you can that use as your SSID. Okay? Yeah, yeah. Because he's mm -hmm. having his own company ID. 
So it's a restriction, mm -hmm. sir, confidential, right? Yeah. Yeah. I don't know how to get my SSH user ID. Where do I find it? <laughs> <laughs> you Actually, you, I, you, yeah. you go to the SAP website and you put your email address and click uh, forget password. You will receive all uh, your, if, uh, one, uh, your SSID is linked to your email. Definitely, you will get receive the email. Otherwise, anonymously, you can enter. Okay. And to, you can enter to the portal. Uh, without because SAP it is putting uh, as a project methodology it's not the issue only the thing is that we have to reach that portal and knowledge base that most probably I don't know how many project manager they are browsing uh, as activate methodology uh, you, uh, I will send the link from there you can get and one thing more I will send the manual as so how to use that portal Okay. Zahid. Zahid, I'll tell you. Yeah, Zahid, I'll tell you. Yeah, yeah. Tell me. You, you can send me whatever you want. If I'm not mm -hmm. able to access, you drop off. You will say that it's night for me. And then I come tomorrow morning. I have wasted all my weekend. So send me the link. Let me log into the link. Let me see what technical <laughs> issues I have. If somebody can help me get access, that's all I'm looking for. Whether it's you, whether it's technical team, I don't really care about that. No problem. I, I will do yeah. Yeah, okay. okay, no problem. No worries. No worries. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Exactly. 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 If you don't have any problem to sharing the credentials, this is no problem. No so, problem. Actually, see, yeah. see, we are uh, providing uh, how to catch the fish. We are not give, uh, catching the fish and giving to the training. <laughs> okay. Okay, no problem. Uh, so you can because see, this is a knowledge. Uh, we have to share it. No problem. In in any, any way, he uh, he have the access. He, he is the common man, and he can get from the website also. But my expertise is that SAP each level. I know where is the training is residing and from where to get with ID without ID both way. So I will send the links. No problem. How to send link? That just tell me, uh, Zaheer. Uh, I send to you. Yeah, you can what? send me all detail to my mail. I will forward mm -hmm. to him. Okay. okay, I will send the both things. Uh, one uh, link and he will enter to the website. Manesh, no problem. It's very easy. You will not uh, face any problem. Okay. Second, I will send you the manual also. Okay. Okay. Hello. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, tomorrow, what will be the training uh, session timing? Tomorrow he's asking for uh, early morning. Morning, no problem. Six thirty. Yeah. Okay. See, uh, okay. Okay. Done. So Done. it will be. So oh, one, one second. One second. One second. Saturday and Sunday. Let me off. let you know. No, not off. Let me let me do one. So um, tomorrow is Saturday, right? So for you it will be for you long now. Actually, what is it? So uh, there is. Uh, hold on. Uh, is having the second batch, okay? The second weekend batch as well on Saturday, Sunday. But for tomorrow, he will take the one sessions. For next coming Saturday, Sunday, he will be busy, okay? So for uh, tomorrow, he will take uh, one sessions, okay? It will be uh, your evening and his morning. Since no, no, one second. No, no. They, 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 on the weekends, evening may be a little issue, so I'll work with him on the timing part. So, Zahir, um, what what time are you available? Uh, uh, tomorrow. Uh, so, you are in Saudi Arabia, right? Uh, no, right now I'm in uh, Pakistan. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So, he One will second. be available at, uh, it's, it will be our morning 6.30. And it will mm. be your evening as per EST time. No, tomorrow, tomorrow yeah. evening, tomorrow evening, I may not be available. That's why I'm trying to see if we can do in the afternoon or morning, like around this time, to noon or something, like the way we did it. Uh, okay, one Monday. thing, do as you see, uh, I'm also uh, tomorrow traveling uh, uh, from here to Islamabad. So most probably, uh, Zaheer will coordinate with you for the timing. I will give him sure. a lot and he will coordinate 
as per your schedule he will fit it to sure, okay sure. okay no problem let's yeah. do it. okay okay that makes uh, sense uh, mr uh, munesh right now website is open you can see my screen yeah yes okay yes, i can okay uh, this is a address you can see on the top okay and uh, welcome to roadmap viewer okay here he is, is saying yes sign in or no access okay anonymously i'm clicking here second one see hello yeah i'm here okay now you have roadmap viewer okay okay uh, overview how to use second one get step by step instructions you have you will get here how to use step by step instructions you will get pdf okay third learn more and last one sap cloud alm application life management uh, life cycle management this is cloud based project management implementation cloud centric solution clear mm -hmm. this is the website okay in overview you can see what does a roadmap viewer offer second uh, guess third one you can see explore the roadmaps clear mm -hmm. i'm going explore the roadmaps okay yes. now we have three areas cloud specific methodology on premise upgrade and general methodology which methodology you want you choose it okay i am choosing sap activate cloud public edition three systems landscape uh, development quality and production mm -hmm. okay i am clicking here no you have overview here you have total project plan here this uh, or top you have phases and uh, left side you have uh, uh, well, this is a uh, uh, project management work streams in that in one phase you have all areas that uh, this is actually diagram if we go to the contents Yes. See, here you have phases, work teams, products, and more. These are the tools. Now, you what you will do, uh, you will take from here which work teams uh, go here, product. Product. You are saying SAP S for HANA Cloud. I will choose this. Automatically, it is limitizing my project plan. If I remove it, if you want to see complete all, so in discover, you will go cloud trial because you need to know the cloud trial, what is offering. Okay. Uh, you are following my voice is clear, Mr. Manish? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. No, no, no. here in learn learn on sap cloud trial or here partners demonstration landscape partner initial access to sap me this is telling you that how you will use your ssid sap ssid for your company it will give you a portal in that portal you have all things with you because my uh, today SAP website not working. Otherwise, I can show you also the how it will work. Okay, I'm going from here. Learn on SAP S for HANA Cloud Trial System. I will click here.
yesterday it was working very fast. Okay. Now here you have uh, contents. You are now in learn on SAP S for HANA trial. You have accelerators. You can see here theory. And here it will be the templates. How to use to show to your customer or your end user or steering committee. Everything is available here in accelerator. Yes. See here you have discover these are the files uh, you can from here download uh, in that uh, uh, here uh, you have business uh, platform as I had accelerated uh, web, these are the web pages and these are the files uh, left side you will see the files. Here are the files okay. So uh, I will go in other um, uh, discover file because it's a cloud. It's a saying that request to ALM and central configuration and request to cloud uh, discovery assessment, executing the discovery access. Uh, let me take this. Each section, it have a documentation, complete documentation. See, this is PDF. This is also PDF cloud ALM function, uh, two tire ERP deployment SAP cloud PDF. If I click here, the PDF will come. So in a way you can go and you can go. Okay, clear. I didn't see that PDF. Can you open and show me the output when you okay, click on just, it? Please. Just, just a minute. Okay, and then you have all the slides here. All the slides. You will get even templates, master data templates. Uh, actually, if we are in start. This I'm showing you start of the project, but you can go uh, to mm, the, in discover uh, area that contents. Just a minute. Discovery. So can you do me a favor? Yeah. Can you do me sure. a favor? Sure. The class, the session, what you have taken. Yeah. We, we were doing discover. So let's go into discover. Under discover, mm -hmm. where are those slides which you are showing us? As a session. Actually, I took that uh, case. Uh, just a minute. I need to check. Uh, I have to go to home. See. No, yes, please, please, please. No, no, no. See, yeah. all I'm saying is, Zahid, Zahid, you may yeah. have used this tool for a while now. So you are yeah, yeah. pretty familiar. Yeah. So all I'm trying to understand is browse through, go through this. If it's, all these slides are there, great. All I need is access to this. When you mm. click on, when you send me the link, I will click on and see what, how, whether I have access or not. That's all my, then you have resolved my question now or, or you have yeah. answered my question. Right. So I just yeah, need yeah. to understand where on. are those slides. Yeah, correct. I'm going, I'm going. This is all very impressive, but it's going to take one week for me to get used to all this different tools, application, what it is, what it contains. Even I'm familiar with, but I have need to go again and again to check what is, Correct. Uh, Correct. yeah, uh, really, because see, it's a lot of files are there. Right now you can see the prepare analytic cloud here, data consideration enable how to. Okay, uh, one thing I will do, uh, I have the, uh, just a minute, um, Excel sheet. Because I downloaded the product from here, I'm taking care.
Yes. Here is the file. Okay. Hello. Hello. Yeah, I am here. Yeah. Mm, yeah. See, this is saying that activate community, uh, SAP activate uh, public this, and here is the source. And uh, this is a uh, text file. And this is the file activity. And uh, this is the link from it is can be downloaded. So I took from here gradually as per your uh, theoretical part, you given me ACT one. But if I'm going through here, uh, this website, it's gone. So in, in this way, gradually we are going, uh, I, as I told you, ACT and ACT 100 and ACT 2 are the academic books, okay? Uh, you've given me basics, uh, roles, uh, backlogs. I took from the project the key uh, parts which you were planning to ask me uh, to arrange the course, okay? Academically, I arranged these uh, slides. I can send you these slides and also mm, you can browse the project. Uh, so I think this is at prepare level, uh, You uh, these slides will come and not in discover level. In discover level, we are only browsing the software that what uh, trial and what is the uh, SAP products. In prepare, you will find these agile activity and other project management things. No, but discover, uh, but, how, how did you, so how did you manage to get those slides in discover? Uh, uh, well, uh, see, uh, for uh, for discover, I, I downloaded. Uh, uh, I um, uh, clicks on the project. I downloaded these Excel sheets. From Excel sheet, it's giving me uh, these documents. You can see this is uh, file is AG zero three. Okay, if I go to my folder, you can see AG zero two, AG zero three. This is agile responsibility. I mean this. You see, this this is the file. So these links also okay. I can send it to you that you can download very easily. Or this see, see. Zaid, Zaid, I'll tell you something. You, and you, uh, you have you have the knowledge. Please. Only thing is you are talking mm -hmm. a lot of lot of information which is very useful. I need to go through these sessions myself mm -hmm. to ensure that I very easily easy. you can go back. Yes. Yeah. Very yeah. very easily you can go very easily. There is no problem. I'm yeah. saying to you. So if you send me all the links, let okay. me click on the links. I have, I have let I'll confirm you whether I have access or not. Then we can conclude the call. And tomorrow we'll join. Be confident. You will have access to all. Otherwise, if firewall is there, no problem. You will get all the things. It's a common. So yeah, you'll just send you send it to my email, yahoo.com. Okay. okay. Or or however, I don't really care how long it can no directly i don't know so you want me to hold the line till i receive the email yeah yeah uh, zahir zahir is there yeah uh, mr manish hello Hello. Yes, right. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, you are giving me email or you are directly sending? I should send to you. Yeah, you can send me. Okay. My mail ID. Yeah. Okay, I'm sending to you. Okay. 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 Just send send him now. Okay, I'm. I will send. Yeah. 